If you use fluorescent microscopy, I'm sure that you'll be aware of the many shortcomings of the high pressure mercury bulbs used in the light sources. These mercury bulbs represent a serious health and environmental hazard. It is rare for them to actually explode, but when they do, there is a significant risk of exposure to toxic mercury vapour. And due to their short life, these expensive bulbs need changing every few hundred hours, a process which is not always easy. And with mercury, special attention is needed with their disposal. In use, they generate a lot of heat and need time to warm up and cool down, all of which wastes the bulb's already limited life. And if they're left on by mistake, then you're literally burning money. All in all, not the greatest solution. At Cooled, we've developed a new greener alternative to the mercury bulb using light emitting diodes, that's LEDs, to create a high intensity light source that is instant, safer and long lasting. LEDs produce light of a specific colour, so this fits well with the requirements for fluorescent microscopy. Here is an example of our blue P100, ideal for the many common tests carried out in screening laboratories. There are two important features to note here. It is bright. In fact, it's very bright, as bright as 100 watt mercury at this wavelength. The second feature is that it gives a very even area of illumination, a feature which is very important in fluorescence. So you can now replace the mercury on your microscope. No more replacement bulbs, no more bulb changing, no more bulb aligning. And what's more, it's very robust. I wouldn't want to do that to a mercury lamp. The P100 is made up of three components. The LED head, which attaches to the microscope in place of the mercury lamp housing, a simple to use control pod, and a small mains power pack. The P100 is easy to install. All you have to do is to remove the old mercury housing by releasing the fixings. Then the P100 LED head can be fitted in its place. Once fitted and connected to the control pod, the P100 is switched on and off with a simple push of a button. No warm up and no cool down periods to worry about. Simply walk to your microscope, insert the slide, switch on the P100 and view. It's really as simple as that. Up and down buttons allow you to control the intensity in small 1% steps. And you can switch the light on and off as many times as you like. It will not affect the life of the product. Performance of the P100 is similar to your existing light source. These comparison images show that you will get a clear homogeneous image from the P100. Many users find that the contrast is better and with all the added benefits they can never go back to using mercury. So what about environmental issues? Apart from having no hazardous mercury in the product to worry about, LEDs are six times more efficient. By having the LED switched on only when you're actually viewing samples, the Cooled P100 will, in typical everyday use, use only a few percent of the power of your mercury. So, good for the environment, no more health and safety issues, no more bulb changing or aligning, no more logging bulb usage. Simply fit and forget. Long lifetime is a feature of LEDs. The P100 is designed to last for at least 10,000 hours. That could be as much as 100 times the life of a mercury lamp. But remember, by switching the LEDs on only when you are viewing samples and off for the rest of the time, you should expect this light source to last for at least 15 to 20 years. That's the life of a microscope. You can have all the benefits of LEDs, long lifetime, ease of use, instant on off, for the cost of a handful of replacement mercury bulbs. In many cases, the payback is within one year. So join the many screening laboratories worldwide that are turning their backs on mercury, having easier lives and saving money.